watery discharge, irritation, itching, lid swelling, redness, and pain in the eyes. These are the top complaints of the majority of patients visiting emergency departments of several hospitals and eye clinics across Delhi NCR. Blaming the heavy monsoon and humid weather conditions, doctors call it an epidemic of eye flu, which is likely to hit the peak in the next one week. India's largest public hospital, Ames New Delhi, has been recording more than 100 cases of conjunctivitis every day. Similarly, on Monday, super speciality Holy Family Hospital, New Delhi, recorded around 42 cases of conjunctivitis out of 75 patients in their eye care OPD. The cases are more than previous years and the epidemic is expected to hit the peak soon and cases will start going down by the first week of August. Experts said that the increase in cases can be linked to the higher rainfall this year in comparison to the last 2-3 years. Additionally, during the previous years, people were taking more precautions due to the outbreak of the COVID-19 pandemic, which could have helped in reducing the spread of conjunctivitis. The current outbreak of conjunctivitis is primarily caused by the adenovirus, which is a common virus responsible for such type of flus. Adenoviral conjunctivitis is a self-limiting condition and no specific antiviral medications are effective against it. While the viral infection of the eyes settles on its own in a few days, sometimes secondary bacterial infection can also occur. In such cases, doctors advise the use of antibiotic eye drops. While such infections are contagious and can fastly travel from one person to another, people generally take five to six days to recover. In some cases where infections are topped up by bacteria or other complications, it takes around two weeks to get well. Now what to do? Experts said that the conjunctivitis is typically self-resolving and rarely causes any permanent damage to eyes. However, in some cases, the cornea can be affected and it needs treatment. Doctors advise avoiding touching eyes along with maintaining hand hygiene. Refrain from sharing your towels to minimize the risk of transmission and use medications as prescribed by your doctor and avoid self-medication with over-the-counter drugs. Especially for girls and women, doctors suggest that they should avoid sharing eye cosmetics or mascara to prevent contamination. Also, if you are suffering from this flu, avoid using contact lenses until it has resolved and the use of protective goggles is also suggested. Take care.